Today I'm going to show you how to open a bunch of images all at once in Photoshop. So sometimes I want to use a bunch of different images and make a frame for instance. And I want, the only options you really have are place embedded or place linked. So if I were to place something, for instance, let's place this B in here. That's great, but what if I wanted to place like that entire folder and do a whole thing with a bunch of options? I don't have to repeat that every single time. So what I'm gonna use instead is a script that's already loaded into your Photoshop for you. So we have scripts and we're gonna use load files into stack. We're gonna click browse and we're gonna select everything that we want. I'm just going to do all of these blue flowers for now. It can slow down my computer a little bit while I'm recording, so I'm not gonna do a million of them, but you really can do as many as, basically as many as your RAM will allow. So I'm just gonna click okay here. And then what's nice is you can actually browse again from a different folder and add something to the list. So those were all the blue ones and they added that vectors elegance to the list. So. I'm going to um, click OK. There are a couple um, other options you can use here, but I'm just going to click OK and let that run. And while that's running, I'm just going to say, hi, I'm Lady. I'm a wedding invitation designer. I have a full course on frame building where I teach you how to make beautiful frames out of elements like this, where to find elements like this, how to use them in your stationary designs. Um, and that's part of my membership, Stationary School, which is a membership where I send out new lessons just for stationary designers every month. So I'll link that in the description for you if you're interested in joining Stationary School. Otherwise, I have tons of great Photoshop, Adobe Creative Cloud, stationary design, uh, and business related videos on my channel. So here we have all of our different files. They're loaded in as layers, automatically named to what they are and loaded on top of each other. So this is the time when I typically decide to start resizing everything. And all of these are in here ready for you to use as individual layers. So you can do whatever you want with them now. And there we go. We have loaded all of our files into stack. Just as a reminder, it's file scripts and load files into stack. Here's an example of the frame that I'm going to make in that frame making course I mentioned with just tons and tons of different elements. And I absolutely used this script to get them all into that file before I started organizing and making this frame. So it's a really, really helpful option when you're using a lot of different PNGs or just want to put a lot of different things into your Photoshop file. Let me know what questions you have on Photoshop. I hope you'll join our membership if you're interested in becoming a stationary designer. Thanks everybody.